Launching a report by World Vision on the effects of COVID-19 on children, it was noted that children are important players in achieving the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. Decision makers were urged to consult children on what works best for them instead of making decisions on their behalf. Allowing that child to participate, if it's planning for the child, let even the child be part of the planning. If you want to buy something for the child, let him or her know. Because even what you are planning, it's for them. And they know, at times they might be knowing what they really like. Rosa Malango, the UN resident coordinator to Uganda, says the COVID-19 inspired lockdown presented major challenges to children, including but not limited to defilement and rape. She says the community should always be held accountable to the authorities for such occurrences. Because there's no way a child can be raped and nobody knows. So, and that is why I was actually making a call today that I hope at some point there will be a legal adjustment so that anybody who lives in the vicinity of where a kid has been defiled and raped and you didn't say anything, you're just as accountable as the person who defiled that child. In response, the Minister of State for Youth and Children Affairs, Florence Nachuala Chienji, urged government to increase the funding for children affairs to protect them from the vagaries of development. There's a lot of corruption and there's also negligence that children's issues are not that important. They are more interested in political issues, they are more, more interested in current affairs, it's like 5%. So that is shared. When you come to the ministry alone of gender, which is directly responsible, the percentage goes far lower to 3.6 billion a year. And this is money that is used to feed children in the remand homes and reception centers, follow-on programs, welfare, counseling and evacuation exercises. The minister also observed that the finance ministry has lagged behind in providing funds meant to remove children from the major streets in the country. Hey, Olivia Komgisha, NTV News. Please, please.